anterior barbell raise, this is what you do not want to do. So this is what you guys want to do for the anterior barbell raise. Keep your abs tight, waist tucked in. Bring the bar to your eyebrows. If you want to isolate your biceps properly on a preacher curl machine, just make sure you keep your arms resting against the cushion. If your elbows lift off, you're going to start bringing momentum and your front delt. We don't want that. We just want to work your biceps. In this video, I want to teach you how to properly do an RDL. A couple common mistakes I see is too much bend happening at the knees and also that back rounding. You have to be able to set a glass of water on your back, so you got to make sure it is flat. You should also be able to maintain this as you come all the way up. Now you don't want to excessively be arching your back, but you have to learn how to properly hip hinge. So we're gonna get that rib cage down to engage the core, and we're gonna shoot those hips back. Think soft knees. You're pretty much maintaining this tightness while you're bending at the waist and filling that stretch in the hamstrings. Here is trap bar RDL, one of my favorite movements. And uh, as you can see here, I'm performing the RDL properly. how you do not want to perform the lateral raise. So this is how you guys want to perform the lateral raise for your shoulders. Waist tucked tight, abs straight, bring your arms out, fingers point down, like you're saying thumbs down. Fingers point down, keep that elbow bent, not straight. <laughs> 